Hello traders, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to analyze the candlesticks one by one on OTC market. Okay, this is Euro USD. The trend is uptrend here, and a ranging market. Okay, the buyers are here. Okay, I think this is a bad market. So many weeks, but I will try. Okay, a strong rejection from bias area. I think the next candle will go more up. Okay, I'm going to place a call option. I place a call option here because I can see strong bias entry and again a buying pressure. It means buyer will easily form a bullish candle. That's why I place a call option. Okay, and the next seller's area is here. The next seller's area is right here. Okay, it's a strong bullish can do. I will shift it to this level. Okay. And I can see, I can see a strong rejection. Okay, a strong seller's area. I think okay but okay I'm going to place a call option I place a call option because I can see some bias entry from this level and this is sellers area if I should go with sellers in the next candle the bullish candle will easily form a bullish candles here so that means the power of bias is very strong to go with bias let me change the line to this level. This level. Okay, strong sellers area. Now I can see a bullish movement. I will change my level to this level. Okay. I can see rejection from that level crosses the seller's area a strong body so i'm going to place i'm going to place a call option i place here a call option because i can from this level and a strong a strong bullish candle it means the next candle will go more up from this level because it broke the seller's area let me see if I can find a seller's entry. My trend line. Okay. And again, let me draw thing from this level to this. If I can see any seller's entry. Okay, I think it's very close. Okay. If this candle will close as a weak bullish, I will go with sellers because it's already at the sellers area. Okay, a spinning top candle. You can see. Let me place a put up a put option here, but I will wait for the right moment. Okay. I place a put option here because because of this spinning top, a weak bias entry, and again. This is a rejection from sellers, a lower rejection also means that seller will still go more down from this level because this is sellers area. That's why I place a put option. Okay. It's very simple to trade using candlestick psychology. The candle or the market can go against you, but the candlestick psychology can beat any type of market now i think this will be my last trade okay gave me a winning trade so you can see this one this one this one this one all are winning trades okay 
I will explain the traits again. Okay, here I place a call option because let me show you because of this bias area. This bias area I can see bias entry from this level, and again a rejection from bias. Let me show you a rejection from bias, and this is bias area. It means the next candle will go more up. And here, I place a call option because, let me show you, okay, because I can see strong, strong bias entry and a strong buying pressure, strong buying pressure, buying pressure. It means they will easily form a bullish candle. That's why I place a call option. You can see. And the next level is here. You can see buying pressure. Okay. You cannot respect that area. You can see bias entry, bias entry, bias entry. So they will not respect this area. Because they will easily form a bullish candle. Can see they will easily form a bullish candle here, yeah. so they will not respect sellers' area. Yeah, I place a call option because let me show you. Okay, this is sellers' area. Let me show you. This is sellers' area and a strong sellers' entry. And this can do close above the seller's entry with a strong body. So it means the next can do will go more up. That's why I place a call option. And here yeah, I place a put option because of this rejection from sellers. And this is seller's area, okay? And a weak body. It means sellers will go more down from this level. That's why I place a put option. You can see strong bias entry. Let me show you. Strong bias entry. But on getting there, the candle form a weak body. You can see strong bias entry, but on getting to the seller's area, let me show you. On getting to the seller's area, you form a weak body. It's strong, strong bias entry from this level. You can see the power of buyer, power of buyer, power of buyer. But here, buyers are becoming weak. That's why you're seeing a seller's movement. So they will continue the market to the next level. So if you like my video, like, share, and subscribe. Thank you.